Hey there, welcome to Sidewalks, the entertainment project. Raphael Siegel here, and we are talking hairspray with one of the stars of the movie, Nikki Blonsky, and director, executive producer, choreographer, Adam Shankman. I need some oxygen. You do all those roles, it's amazing. Uh, yeah, Adam, yeah. Nikki, welcome to Sidewalks. Hey, Thank you for nice having us. Nice to be here. No problem. I know from watching you guys uh, off camera here for, through other interviews, you guys like to be loud. So let's be loud. Why let's not? be loud. Let's yeah. mess the hair for loud and proud. Yeah, yeah, loud and proud. Go big or go home. That's, that's it. That's all I've got. Now, saying. Nikki, congratulations. For the people that don't know, Nikki beat out thousands and thousands of other hopefuls for the role as Tracy Turnblad in this great movie. Take us into that uh, process. Wow. Well, I auditioned like mm. a, while, like, a while ago. Um, I auditioned. Uh, I sent in a tape to New Line. I heard they were casting the movie, and um, and then they got called from the casting director as they viewed the tape, and they said we're doing an open call. Come into New York. Segway five months later. I kept going on uh, callback after callback, and I finally got a screen test. And then they told me they were going to come to each of the four final girls to do um, a videotaped like little diary on them for you know potential backup DVD. footage for for the potential DVD for whichever girl gets it and for me they want to come to a cold stone creamery because that's where I was working and they came and they opened up a laptop and they said would you mind watching some of the other people's screen tests this after by the way after they made her make a Sunday so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> little, little. who then ate that Sunday I'm just curious but I think our new line Mark executive Shane, uh, Mark Kaufman. Mark Kaufman yeah ate it. I little executive. did I know that I was making ice cream for a new line executive. Um, uh, but, and then they, you know, Adam Shankman popped up on the screen and he said, Hey, Nikki, I think you should go make yourself a big ice cream cone because you're going to be playing Tracy Turnblad in the new Hairstream movie. Well, we saw the footage, uh, it's on the little uh, press kit that we have, uh, that we're watching in the other room and you're just like, <laughs> you know, <laughs> great yeah. reaction. I wouldn't call that, by the way, the most flattering imagery of me or necessarily of you, but I think, you know, I it, was real. it was it very, was very, very real. It was 100% real, and yeah. that's what I'm proud I, of. Guys, I taped that thing after, after spending the day um, choreographing, um, um, I think, Welcome to the 60s, so I was, I was literally like on death's door, I was so tired. And then they're like, oh, by the way, you have to tape the message to Nikki, and I was like, Bring it on. Bring there it you go. Her, you know. Now, uh, what was it about Nikki when you saw the tape and saw her auditions throughout the process that you were like, you know what, this is our new Tracy. This is her. It was her. First of all, she was a real teenager, and that was that was essential to me. And and by a real teenager, I mean both very real and also a teenager. Right. And uh, um, she was also outrageously confident and really comfortable in her body. And she she sold. The songs when she sang it with like I mean she she shook things that I still am marveling at. <laughs> Very nice to this day. And Thank but you. it was but it was it was just unabashed joy and and confidence and exuberance and it was like you just felt the honesty of what was coming out of her. You know there was no act going on. So that's what I knew that I wanted. We saw the movie and it definitely shows. Now you uh, your co-stars are A-listers in the business. Who are you most excited to meet and work with? I, I know maybe it's hard to pick one. Ooh. In the future? No, no, in this movie. So in other words, oh, you know who your you? co-stars are in this movie, and you say, oh, I can't but wait see, to But when she got cast, I don't know if we had everybody. Yeah, I, I knew about John and Queen Latifah, and I was just freaking out. Like, I was like, John Tarleton, Queen Latifah. I mean, Queen Latifah is one of my idols. Like, I don't even think I've ever gotten to tell her, like, what a huge impact she had on me growing up. Um, I watched her show, or Queen Latifah talk show, and... I loved Queen Latifah, so I'm gonna say. Well, now you watch Ricky Lake. You're like a talk show girl. I know. It's like, uh, she's a Sally Jesse. I was a big Sally Jesse. <laughs> you were. Fan. Yeah, the red glasses yeah. were awesome. Um, but no, and of, well, of course, John Travolta. He's the greatest, greatest, you know, musical star of all time. So to work with him was just an honor, and then to have him play my mom was really cool. The best musical star of all time till now, Nikki's here. Oh, <laughs> right. thank Shoot. you. This is where we kiss a little butt here on the in the show. Wow. Uh, no. So uh, how does this version? Up Adam <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. How does this version differ from the uh, version that came out in '88, and then subsequently the uh, stage version? Well, you would never. There, there's no reason to go in and just remake a John Waters cult classic because that would just be rude and wrong. You know, I mean, he's too. It's too brilliant. So. Um, when this movie got made uh, into a Broadway show, you know, it had sort of a natural progression evolution. So this is just an adaptation of the Broadway show. Mm -hmm. but, but I absolutely go back to a lot of the anarchy and a lot of the irreverence of John Waters uh, and his humor while maintaining all of the 
total joy of the play, you know. So you can very, very safely bring your kids to it, but there is a lot for adults in there. There's a, there's a Where's Waldo of of um, naughtiness. And That's it's right. very, very deep inside the thing, but it's, it's, it's all just, you know, for, for fun, you know, and, and it's like total summer fun. Now, uh, we want to finish off here on Sidewalks with some advice from you to an aspiring actress out there. Absolutely. Um, the bottom line is you never give up. No matter what your dream is, no matter who you are, what nationality, what race, what sexuality, it doesn't matter. Whoever you are, if you have a dream, go for it. It doesn't matter. And just believe in yourself and, and love life. And take it one day at a time and just have a blast because you only live it once. Nikki Blonsky, Adam Shankman, thank you so much for joining us here on Sidewalk. Thank you. Thank you very, very, very much. They're fun. Yeah, we're fun. They're goofy. <laughs> we're crazy. <laughs> You're crazy, Tracy. <laughs> <laughs>